everyone welcome or welcome back if you're new to this channel my name is Jen and today I'm gonna do a review on a purchase I just made it's the NIV faith life illustrated study Bible now <laughs> the reason I want to tell you about this so I asked my sister she's three years younger than me and her birthday was a couple days ago and I had asked her I said what do you want for your birthday this year obviously I didn't give it to her yet I'm gonna be going home to see her on Thanksgiving uh, and she said, you know what, I'm really looking for a study Bible, uh, one that has like lots of notes and commentary to help me understand. She's like, but there's just so many choices out there. She's like, I don't know which one to get. I'm like, I got you. <laughs> and um, I didn't know what I was getting myself into because I started to do the research, just kind of looking to see what was out there, what was available. And there's a lot. <laughs> um, and when I first saw this one, like this one really caught my eye and attention. So if you're in the market for a study Bible, so I have, I actually have three of my own personal Bibles. So I have uh, Celebrate Recovery is a program that I was a part of. So I have the Celebrate Recovery study Bible. And then this is my main one that I put in my purse and take to church with me, you know, nice and pretty. But when I came across this one, like, I think I want to get this one for myself as well. Like, I mean, it's it's a hefty one, so maybe not one that I'm taking to church with me on Sundays, um, but one to have at my desk that when I'm, like, studying, studying the Bible, really want to, like, dig into things uh, to get this. So I first went on ChristianBook.com, and they only had it in black, and they had this really pretty, like, turquoise color that I think my sister will really appreciate. Uh, so this one I actually got on Amazon, and it was about $50. Um, so for the rest of this video, I'm really just gonna like flip the camera around and we're gonna uh, have like an overhead look at this Bible. But like I said, you know, it's pretty, pretty hefty there, but it's just, oh, it's so pretty. Um, and I think when we get into it, into it uh, you'll be able to see like why I chose this one and why I want one of these for myself. All right, let's go ahead and flip the camera around. Okay, so I'm just going to kind of flip through and uh, we'll stop on some of like um, just the pictures or diagrams. There's a timeline um, and, and things like this just really help me to just see what was happening, when was happening. So here, introduction to Genesis. I love that it has this map here. You can, again, kind of visualize what is where. Like these, oh, these illustrations are just beautiful. So here, like on these two pages here, the verses are here. So it only has verses one through seven and the rest of these are notes. Um, and I just love that. It kind of gives you insight into uh, like what the Hebrew words were for different things. Okay, oh, that's so beautiful. <laughs> Again, more Hebrew words. I mean, it just really helps to understand um, the Bible. So again, as we're flipping through here, you know, the verses are on top here and all these down here are just more, you know, notes and commentary uh, on the verses just to kind of give you a deeper understanding. So you have like furnishings of the tabernacle. Oh, that's really neat. Wow, I like that. Israelite festivals. Ooh. Family trees. Oh, can't tell you how helpful that'll be. Uh, <laughs> sometimes it's hard to keep track of who's from who and <laughs> who goes where. Royal seals of Judah. And again, everything under this green line on every page is... Um, notes to help you study and understand different things. Another family tree. I think at the beginning of every book they have like just this really nice introduction. Gives you the background of it with the map. That's really neat. There's a chart with uh, timelines and dates. Ezekiel's temple. Oh, that's really cool. The timeline of Jesus' early life and ministry. Oh, this is continued. I guess it 
and continue to get it's a lot of ministry. That's neat. I like that. A chart of all the parables. Herod's Temple on the Temple Mount. Life of Paul. Ooh, what was that? The theater in Ephesus. Wow. Rome in Paul's day. Oh, angels in the Bible. In the very back here we have some, some more maps. Oh, got a lot of maps. Oh, this is neat. Table of weights and measures. Yeah, they don't measure things the way that we do now, so that's interesting. We can compare it to what we would understand it as today. Hmm. So yeah, I just wanted to share a brief over overview on this. Uh, if you've stumbled across this video, it's probably because you were searching for reviews on this particular Bible because you're thinking about purchasing it. Uh, I did the same thing. You know, $50 is a lot of money, so I really wanted to kind of get an idea, you know, was this the right fit for you know, my sister or myself as well. Uh, so hopefully that was helpful. Give you a little bit of insight. They'd be like, yeah, that's, that's what I'm looking for. Or like, mm, no, that's not quite what I'm looking for. Um, so thanks for stopping by and watching this. All right, bye.